Hi Leo, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm going to be doing your August 1st through the 15th love reading. This is for Leo. We'll see what comes up. Thank you for the um, watchers, likes, comments, and subscriptions. I really appreciate that. I just got back from vacation four days and you guys are my first ones. Um, so here you go, August 1st through the 15th. What do you have for Leo? I got a bunch of new uh, crystals, stones, gems while I was there. And I tried to do you got your reading a little while ago, but I had them all right here with me. And I and I ha I know what they mean, but not really. Okay, not fully yet. So, um, <laughs> and I couldn't even do your reading. It was so strong. It was like my face got red. My heart was beating fast. And then I got hot. And it was just like, what the hell? So I threw one of them way over there and the other one way over there. And, um, hmm. And the other one, I don't even know what I did with the other one. But anyway, um, they're not so close anymore. I'm going to have to investigate before I, I put those in. All right, so this is for Leo. I'm going to do the, the Celtic Cross because that's what I want to do. Sorry. My face is still hot on one side, like hot, just one side. <laughs> I don't know what the hell is going on. It's like, whoa. But that four day vacation was a retreat, you know, when you see that retreat card, that's exactly what I did. And oh my God, I didn't do one reading while I was there. It was like four days. So it was like, holy shit. Wow. So anyway, you guys are up first. So, right at the center of the situation, we have the Ten of Wands. So, what is going on? You guys are carrying around a little bit too much. Um, that's what it looks like. This is intended to be a love reading. I think that you guys feel like you've got a big, heavy load on your shoulders. Um, perhaps it has to do with children. You know what I mean? Right now, there's children weighing on your situation regarding love. That's what it looks like to me. Um... Mm -hmm. Ooh wow, look at the tens. Ten, ten, ten. Completions, completions, completions. That's what tens are about. Something big has been completed. Okay, so perhaps you finally made it. It's supposed to be a love reading, but I have to tell you, whatever comes up, comes up. That's what the spirits want you to know, okay, at the time. They, whoever, if it doesn't resonate with you, then... Check your rising sign or your moon sign or who knows. But it will not resonate with everybody, okay? Um, so anyway, it looks like in the past you've just finally acquired this um, abundance in your home life. You just are feeling really, really comfortable at home and this is something new to you. All of a sudden you're feeling really good. Um, perhaps you're feeling really loved and your home is feeling good and comfortable. So it's like, wow! Holy shit, what just happened? All of a sudden, I'm feeling good. This is like, I can't even believe it. Um, but it's still, that's is in the past, okay, what I just said. I'll, that's how you've been feeling. <laughs> then coming in, it looks like, you know, perhaps, you know, there's some moping going on over something. This is coming in. So it may not have happened yet, or it may have just happened. I mean, this is going to resonate with you at the right time, Okay. So here in the in the future we have the daughter of cups looks like oh there is it's still a very lovable situation so there's definitely love or emotional support being offered from somebody um <laughs> Yeah, you're still feeling, this looks really good. This is the 1st through the 15th, you know. This is this is love and this is a passion, okay. So there's a lot of love and passion, so that's awesome. <laughs> but there's no forward movement or what? I mean, is there, is there like, are you guys at like a stalemate or what? Um, hmm. Something is not happening. Something's being ignored. 
something is being ignored. Hmm. All right, so up there in your hopes and fears, we have the world. That's what you're looking for. Okay, you're looking for to start a new chapter with somebody. That's what's going on. That's that's what you want. You know, you're ready to start a new chapter, and it looks like you are damn close. You're going to, not damn close. You're about to start a new chapter. With these tens in this one, you are about to start a new chapter in your life. A long chapter, an important chapter, something very um, prominent, you know, that's going to very prominent in your life is about to start um could be something like um an engagement or a wedding you know a marriage something big could be um getting that ultimate job whatever this is but this is a love reading so this has this is a the beginning of a long term relationship very long term okay that's what it is i mean with all these completions i mean it's it's absolutely amazing it absolutely is the only thing is, is that, do you feel like it's too much? Like, sometimes you feel like, this is too much. It's too much. It's too much too soon. Too much. I mean, is that what this this is? You're carrying around too much? It's like, it's just, woo, blew you away. You know, so it's like, it's a little bit much. Um, it's not that it's not good. It's good, but it's, you know, unknown. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. Um because you you're not used to it. Um we have these two fives right here and fives are generally about changes and conflicts. This is um you're moping around about something, I don't know. Maybe you you're just not sure. You don't feel like you're maybe that's your self-worth or something. You're not you I don't know. You'll know what this is. For some reason, this is coming in. It's either happening or not happening, you know, or already happened. Yeah, it might not be happening because this isn't going to resonate with everybody. So, um, yeah, up here, you're still feeling, okay, everything is good. It's great. You're starting a new phase of life with somebody. You are. But um, you're still feeling insecure um, materialistically. It's almost like you're not quite, um, comfortably secure for some reason. For some reason, you're not comfortably secure. Um, so let's get some clarifiers. So far for people, we have, um, Scorpio, Pisces, or Cancer. For the signs, we could have, um... Well, I'm not even going to say anything because somebody will say something. And Definitely very passionate, loving energy. for some, But something is still being ignored. Is it feelings? I mean, are some feelings being ignored? Something's not being, you know, something's not moving forward. Um, but it, I think it's going to change because we have the world right here. But we'll see. We're going to clarify. Jeez, some crow. Now we have three, five. So that's major life changes. And that is exactly what's going on with you. Is that things are happening that are unknown. And you just, it's just like overwhelming. It is overwhelming. Um... I think, you know, you, you guys, it, there's been, you guys, it's been great. You've just been working on it, working on it, working on it, working on it, you know, and you've been working on it, okay? Um, <laughs> but there's still a lot of tension. I just don't know wh wh why. Something isn't happening that needs to be happening. There's still some work that needs to be done. There's something that needs to be done to reach this. To reach this world card with that new phase of um, your life, which would be a real uh, committed long term relationship with I think you're already with this person. I mean, if you're if you're single, we could have somebody coming in, which is a Pisces, Cancer or Scorpio. If you're not and this person's already here. All right. But there's going to be this is sexual and passionate, but there's still tension. There's still something that's that's being ignored. Okay, so there's still work to be done, but the, you know you got you're working to meet your goal of this new phase in life. 
You are. You're working towards it, and it's coming together quite nicely. Okay. Um, we need to clarify that card up there, that uh, Five of Pentacles. What's this Five of Pentacles about? I'll move that camera in a minute to see if you guys can see it all. Well, that's not very well put together, is it? You have to bear with me while I move things around. Like I said, I just got back from vacation here, my first, so, you know, things aren't very pretty. Sorry about this, but if I push pause, you know, then it takes twice as long to that download. And that's just not going to work for me. Because then I have to edit it, and it's a bunch of bullshit. And, you know, that's how it is. I guess that's a little bit better, isn't it? Yes, I know that's what you're saying. All right. So. <laughs> working, working, working on it. Working on it, working on it. And there's still work to be done, and that's just fine. Okay, because as you keep walking up the ladder, then you will finally, this is your hope. Your, you hope to start this new chapter with somebody. It is going to happen because you are so close to being at the top. You are so close, especially with all these tens. I mean, it is so, so close and it's overwhelming. It is. If you're single, um... I, I think this is people that are coupled, but if it is, if you are single, it's somebody coming in because you have finally become comfortable for yourself, with yourself. You finally love yourself. You're finally getting out there. You're, you're feeling good in all aspects of your life. All right. So that's why this person is here. That's, that's what it is. Um, let's get some of these. Let's get some of these angel romance cards. And this one popped out and landed like this. I don't know if you can see it, but that's how it landed. Just like that. Past life relationship. You have known each other before. Have you? That's probably why it's so freaking overwhelming. That's why you're feeling so overwhelmed. Is because the the attraction is so there. It's like, this is overwhelming. Oh my god. <laughs> Something to do with, ch with children, I think. I do. That is a kind of, you know, causing tension in the relationship. I don't know. I could be wrong, but this is, you know, this is the mother, and this is tension. I mean, what else could it be? It could be other things, but, you know, that's what I feel like it is. Oh, this is a good one. Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. As you're walking up these this ladder with this person and you're building your life together, you know, and you're doing that, remember to keep an open mind, okay? This person is nothing you've been like you've been with before. Your your past life, this guy, who girl, whoever it is, they're not what you think, okay? They it's brand new. It's brand new. So keep an open mind, okay? told you there was going to be passion allow your heart and soul to sing with joy passion I already saw that <laughs> attraction you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully enjoy this enjoy it and you this this web will be even tighter you will get up to the top of the stairs okay you you will then feel secure and your next phase will be so much quicker but it's so quick I mean it's really 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 close really close okay so 
you know, I don't feel the need to draw any more cards. This is what I have for you. Um, thank you for watching, liking, and subscribing. Um, and I will talk to you soon. You know what? I think I'm going to let you see it this way because it's just not right. Did you see this, the stuff when I was seeing you moving up? Building that life together. Getting you so close. You're almost at the top. That's a big one. Enjoy every minute of it. Do not. Do that. Do not mope. There's no reason to mope over anything. There's a lot of passion right there. And right there. A lot of passion. So, that's what I have, Leo. Talk to you soon.